Have you ever wanted to learn to cook but just didn't know where to start? Well, we're the guys from Sorted Food and we've teamed up with Co-op to create Now Cook It. Check out this video from the course. In this video, we're going to show you how to dice an onion. It's slightly different to other vegetables because of its layers. An onion itself has a top, a root that's at the bottom, and the layers grow from the root up towards the top. Knowing where they are helps you to dice it in just a moment. But first up, it's a round vegetable, and we want to flatten it to make it nice and safe. So what we're going to do is cut the top off down towards the board, enough to give you a flat surface, turn it round, and we can do exactly the same with the root, but only a little bit. We want to take off anything that's dusty or soily, but keep that intact because that's what's going to help you keep the onion together when you dice it. Sit it on its top and get rid of the top and bottom. Next, we're going to cut the onion in half. So knife on top, straight through the root, and the fingers are going over the top in a bridge-like motion and cut right the way down. Two halves makes it much easier to peel an onion. Both halves are exactly the same, so we're going to treat them the same, but just one at a time. The root is going to hold this all together, so keep that pointing away from you, and then with a knife, a sharp straight edge knife, we're going to cut parallel lines all the way down to the board, but not quite into the root. The closer these lines are together, the finer your dice will be. You're using the claw motion so that your fingers are well back. At this point, you turn the onion through 90 degrees. Some people like to cut the onion in horizontally, but because of where the layers of the onion are, it's really not necessary. So instead, Clamp it all together with the claw and thumb behind, and then you're going to slice down the opposite directions the way you just have. Those cuts give you diced onion on this side of the knife, and everything on this side is getting closer and closer to the root, just still holding it all together. At any point where this gets a little bit too rickety, just flop it down onto the flat edge and carry on doing exactly the same. After a few slices, you can lift it back up to where it was and carry on again. The closer you can get to the root, the less wastage there'll be, and they'll all come with practice. Get rid of that last bit of root, and what you're left with on the board is diced onion. As you can imagine, we use it in so many of our savoury recipes, so once you've got the hang of the skill, you'll save loads of time when it comes to preparation and cooking.